So you're thinking about moving to Northville. Well, today we're going to give you a tour of Northville Township, a couple different subdivisions, a couple different price points, so you can learn more and be educated on the market here in Northville. And we're going to do that starting right now. Hey guys, thanks for checking out today's video. Today, like I said, we're in Northville Township. Our goal of this video is to educate you here on Northville Township and some of the real estate, different subdivisions and price point of what's currently available on the market and some of the pending sales as well too, so we can help educate you along the way. My name is Matt Talbot. My team and I get calls, texts and emails from people just like you every single day that want to move here to Northville and to Southeast Michigan, and we absolutely live for it. If you're thinking about moving to the area, please comment below, send us an email or hit the calendar link below here in in YouTube and you can schedule a consultation with us today. We're happy to do an introduction, find out more on your situation. Today, like I said, we're here in Northville Township. We want to give you a tour of some of the different areas. Currently, the first place we're touring here is the Enclaves in Northville. Um, the home behind me is actually for sale. So we want to give you a quick tour of the subdivision. Um, this sub actually sells between about six and 800 plus depending. There's only been a handful of sales, excuse me, over the last couple years because it's still a fairly new subdivision. The home behind Behind me was built in 2019. It's for sale at 675. Has close to 3,500 square feet finish, including the basement, about 2,800 square feet above grade. It's a nice quarter lot at the front of the subdivision here, so great option in Northville. These homes were Pulte builds a few years back. Um, really good options here. One of the benefits of the enclaves of this particular subdivision is you're right at Seven Mile and Northville Road. So you can take Northville Road about a mile from here and you're right in downtown Northville. So you're still Northville township taxes not quite walking distance i would say it's definitely biking distance to downtown but you get the best of both worlds additionally if you stand seven mile here you're only a couple miles from Haggerty, which is all your major shopping uh, 275 is that way too to get in and out of town so if you work in a different city this is a great great neighborhood so again northville schools northville township the enclaves ranges from about 600 to about 850 or so depending on the build year and stuff like that so great option for you here at the enclaves 675 currently on the market right now here today. Number two on our list for Northville Township today is one of my favorite subdivisions of all Southeast Michigan. Definitely one of my top tier subs here in Northville Township. And this is Northville Hill Subdivision, Northville Hill Golf Club. The home behind me is actually pending at 995. Not sure where they ended up, but it's about 4,500 square feet, four bedrooms, four and a half baths, finished basement. It's across the street from the golf course. So it's not a golf course lot, but it's on a nice wooded lot. And so Northville Hills here is a great, great option if you're looking for homes really in the 2,800 to 4,800 square feet. So there's a variety of homes here in Northville Hills. We want to give you a quick tour of this subdivision. The subdivision is actually between Five Mile and Six Mile and Sheldon Road and Beck Road. So it takes up a big footprint. And the reason for that is because of Northville Hills Golf Club. So Northville Hills Golf Club is a semi-private golf course, meaning it's open to the public. There's a driving range, a pool, a huge clubhouse. There's a lot of events going up there. We'll show you in a minute here uh, today. I think there's some baby showers and stuff like that because as you can see, it's still spring the leaves haven't even turned yet but um, Northville Hills is a great option the homes really range from about five six hundred up to 1.2 1.3 million depending on size upgrades stuff like that as well um, but it's a very very community feel um, the subdivision selling about $250 a square foot on average so again give and take depending on the type of quality and the type of construction and the type of upgrades that, that you have throughout the subdivision but it's an awesome 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 uh, um, community feel because you have the clubhouse you have the drive 
driving range. There's a lot of stuff to do. There's a restaurant up the way and you're still in the heart of Northville. So Sheldon Road's right here. You take it a couple miles up the street, you're right in downtown Northville. You take it a mile that way, you're on M14, meaning you're 20 minutes to Ann Arbor, you're 25 minutes to Detroit. It's a very central location. Northville schools are very, very sought out. There's uh, Carl's Golf Land across the street, a bunch of restaurants, a Bush's Market, which is a local grocery store here as well too. Um, there's a lot of reasons why Northville Hills makes a lot of sense. And again, behind me, beautiful home at 995, just south of $1 million. It's a great option for people that are seeking out 4,000, 4,500 and up square footage here in Northville. Okay, so one of the best parts of the Northville Hills Golf Club, Northville Hills subdivision and the surrounding communities here is the actual golf course and is the actual golf club. So behind me is the clubhouse and event center. Uh, there's full of, there, there's a lot of different activities and stuff that they do for the local subdivision here throughout the summer. Um, a lot of the local tournaments are here as well too. I played in the chamber uh, golf outing last year. Actually, we we're the uh, 2022 uh, champions uh, for our division. Uh, my cousin invited me, so uh, champion golfer here. But anyway, long story short is there's events here, right? So behind me right now is actually uh, some of the golfers are starting to pour in, even though it's still very much early spring here in Michigan. Uh, I think it's 40 degrees out, but there's still golfers out there. Welcome to Michigan. Um, my fiance actually happens to be uh, behind me as well today because she's here for my cousin's baby shower. So great for baby showers, different events and stuff like that. But the golf club itself has the clubhouse, event space. There's a pool, a driving range, a great practice facility as well for all you golfers. So it gives a very community feel throughout Northville. A lot of the people can walk here to the club. Uh, obviously your first tee and 10th tee right here. It's an 18 hole championship golf course. Beautiful course, plays really well for uh, your, you golfers out there. But this is a huge reason, a huge selling point why Northville Hills is so sought out. Again, you're right in the heart of town here, right at Five Mile in Sheldon. Beck Road is not too far as well too. So, you know, it's really easy to get to Ann Arbor, Detroit. You can go, you know, north, uh, east as well too. Get to Royal Oak, uh, Troy, uh, Auburn Hills isn't crazy far as well too. So people kind of commute from this area very, very sought out. The golf club is a huge feature to that. So it's a total worthwhile investment uh, to look into if you're searching for, you know, really about five, 600 upwards of 1.2, 1.3 million. Leave a message after the fall song. <laughs> Yeah.
So next on our list is the Meadows at North Phil Ridge. This is just past um, Ridge Road off of Six Mile Road. So you keep going down Six Mile to Ridge Road from Beck Road. And we're actually in front of the neighborhood clubhouse, which is behind me. There's a pool down there. It's still early spring, so it's not open yet, but beautiful landscaping, huge pond. There's a, a playscape as well too. So a lot of people can kind of walk throughout the subdivision. It's a big subdivision. The Meadows itself is actually single family homes. And there's also condos behind me as well too. So if you're looking for more of that $300,000 price point, that is a good price point. The reason, uh, that is a good area I should say for those condos. Um, the reason why I want to show you the Meadows is the home up the street will drive by and kind of show you the exterior, maybe pop up some photos from the MLS as well too. Just went pending at 675, which is a good example of sort of what you're going to get on average in Northville Township. So right now, the current average home sale in Northville Township is actually $675,000. So that's right in the middle of the road, give or take. Um, that home's priced at 215 a square square foot on average Northville is selling for about 226 a square foot again that's across all single family homes taking condos out so um, it's a little bit of a loaded question to sort of look at properties from just price per square foot status but that being said it's an important data point so this is right now an average home on average across Northville of what you're going to be about 675 in Northville Township again we're at Ridge and Six Mile um, next on our list we'll also jump across the street to uh, Steeple Chase as well too but we'll give you a quick tour and show you what this subdivision looks like as well. In Northville Township, actually a lot of Southeast Michigan, definitely in the 275 corridor in the subdivision type vibes, you're gonna have a lot of walking paths like this, okay? So um, let's walk up here a little bit to kind of show you, but these subdivisions for the most part have different walking areas throughout. I know depending where you're moving from in the country, there's gonna be different versions of that. Some places maybe like Texas are very spread out and there's tons of it, but some of these subdivisions, you know, in the six, seven, 800,000, they've done a good job having decent sized lots and also leaving some room for exploring. Um, a lot of people take advantage of these walking paths and stuff like that too. So there's a lot of this type of stuff throughout Northville Township and here in Southeast Michigan. Uh, so like I was saying, the, the home that is pending at 675 is right behind me to give you a sample set of what that looks like. It sits up on a hill, the pond is behind it, so it's a great view. There's a lot of reasons. They actually sold multiple offers in like a couple days, so not sure where they'll end up. They'll probably end up a little bit closer to 700 when it's all said and done, but 675 in Northville Township, this is what it looks like behind me, and we'll give you some more drive-through shots as well of the subdivision so you can see what it looks like here. the message after the fall song.
So last but not least is Steeple Chase. This is one of my favorite subdivisions in all of Northville and definitely Northville Township. It's right across the street from Northville Ridge where we just came from. Um, we're right here, again, past Ridge Road, down Six Mile Road. Really, this subdivision runs from Six Mile Road to Seven Mile Road, and again, in that Ridge Road area as well too. So beautiful subdivision. There's about 275 homes in here. We're gonna take you uh, by one of the homes that just went pending at 1.9 million, so about $2 million. The home prices really range from about uh, 700,000 to 2.5 million depending. And there's a big range of variety of size of homes in here as well too. Most of them are really uh, 3,000 to about 6,600 square feet. So you can still end up in a five, 6,000, 7,000 square foot sub uh, home in this subdivision in Steeplechase. So for those of you that are looking for, you know, maybe something around a million dollars, give or take, you need a bigger home, maybe you have a bigger family or for whatever reason, you really want something, you know, four to 7,000 square feet. This is a great option in Northfield Township. You still have a subdivision vibe. Um, there's also a community pool. There's a nature center, uh, Thayer's uh, Corners Nature Park. They have their own park. So we'll give you a tour. We wanna show you around what Steeplechase has to offer. Okay, so we wanted to show you one of the pending homes here in Steeplechase. The home behind me just went pending at 1.9 million. So that home's about 6,000 square feet, five bedrooms, six bathrooms. It's a big home with some really nice landscaping throughout. Uh, with Steeplechase here, there's different phases as the big sub, uh, 274 lots, I think to be exact. And this is the last phase. So these homes were built in 2020, uh, 2021 in that area. And so that, that home behind me is 2020, uh, again, pending at 1.9 million I don't know where they're gonna end up but again if you're looking for that bigger home a five six thousand square foot um, house you need a five bedrooms you need all the bathrooms for the family or relatives visiting what have you uh, steeplechase is a great option as you can see they're beautiful homes we'll give you some more of the tour drive-bys as well too so you can see what the exterior looks like and we'll also jump on the MLS to show you a couple of pictures of the interior as well um, big massive double staircases in this one that's a, a known feature for Toll Brothers and some of these high-end homes um, and just a fantastic layout Outs as well too. I really, really like this subdivision. I think there's a lot of benefits for people that are really into that um, 700 to $2 million range somewhere in there and need that bigger house and still want that subdivision feel. You don't want to be tucked in the country. You don't want to be on a couple acres. Steeplechase has that to offer. Community pool, walking, um, the, the park up the street, all that great stuff. And you're right here at Six Mile and Ridge. So you're only about three, four minutes to back road and only about five minutes to M14 or you can go north to 96, not too terribly bad down back road as well too. There's lots of grocery stores and shopping as well. So Steeple Chase, great option behind us off Shag Bark at 1.2 million. That's that. here at Thayer's Corner Nature Area, um, just outside of Steeplechase. So the reason why we're tying this into Steeplechase is there's actually a walkway that goes right through the subdivision here. I'm sorry, right through the woods here, right into the subdivision. So a lot of people go for a walk, they go for a jog, or a lot of times they take the dog for a walk and kind of walk through here into this beautiful private nature area. It's gorgeous back here, it's super quiet. You hear the frogs going and stuff like that. It's very, very peaceful. As you can see, they have the barns and stuff like that for storage. Um, there's a gazebo you can rent out as well too over here here and behind me is actually gardening so what people do is you actually rent a portion of the uh, um, of the area to garden so you can grow your vegetables and stuff like that throughout the year to be able to come out and harvest them 
for the area. So this is basically part of Steeplechase in my opinion because it, Steeplechase really surrounds um, this nature area. Um, but Northfield Township has a lot of this stuff. Mayberry State Park's right up the way. Um, additionally, you know, there's parks throughout Northfield Township on both sides of town. And a lot of these more wooded lots and wooded areas as well too, kind of woven throughout the different subdivisions. So the subdivisions have, have came in obviously afterwards, but a lot of these, you know, nature areas and golf courses exist in Northfield Township or on the outskirts when you roll into Salem Township or uh, um, South Lyon as well too, which is nearby. So we want to give you a rundown of Thayer's Corner Nature Area right next to Steeple Chase. If this video provides any value to, to you, please like and subscribe. Also, comment below if there's other areas or other locations that you'd want footage of to understand more about living in or moving here to Southeast Michigan. We'd really appreciate it. Also tap for notifications. Thank you, thank you so much for tuning into today's video. We appreciate the opportunity to show you around town. Home is where the cowboy is.